Welcome back to the Lights Out Podcast. Bedtime stories for boys and girls around the world. Good evening, boys and girls. Are you ready for bed? Are you all snuggled up and ready for another Lights Out Bedtime story? Good, because you're in for a treat tonight. We have a book called The Way Back Home by Oliver Jeffers. And I was looking through all the books I've read this year, about 300, and for some reason, Oliver Jeffers, The Way Back Home, and How to Catch a Star, have about 50 downloads, whereas all the rest have thousands, and I'm not sure why, so I thought I'd like to read them again and see if we can breathe a bit of life back into this amazing author's books. Because Oliver Jeffers has to be one of the best authors and illustrators ever. But back to the story, because it's all about the story. The Way Back Home by Oliver Jeffers Once upon a time There was a boy, and one day, as he was putting his things back into the cupboard, he found an aeroplane. He didn't remember leaving it in there, but he thought he'd take it out for a go right away. The plane lifted off the ground and up into the sky, higher and higher and higher. Suddenly, the plane spluttered. It had ran out of petrol. Now the boy was stuck on the moon. What was he to do? He was all alone and afraid. And soon his torch began to go out. Up in space, someone else was in trouble too. His engine had broken down and steering the ship towards a flicker of light, he landed on the moon with a bump. Both the boy and the Martian could hear noises in the dark and both feared the worst. But as their eyes got used to the dark, they both realized they'd met someone else in trouble. They weren't alone anymore. The boy showed the Martian his empty petrol tank and the Martian showed the boy his broken engine. Together, they thought of ways to fix their machines and how to get them both back home. The boy jumped down to earth to get the things they would need right down into the sea and swam towards home. But by the time he got there, the boy was tired out, so he sat in his favourite chair, just to catch his breath. His favourite programme was just starting, and he settled down to watch. Suddenly, he remembered what he should be doing and rushed off to the cupboard to get what he needed. He ran outside and he shouted, but there was no reply. He couldn't be heard. The boy climbed to the higher ground, called again and waited. This time a rope was lowered. The boy began to climb and the Martian began to pull and soon the boy was back on the moon. The boy fixed up the Martian's engine with the right spanner and the Martian filled the boy's petrol tank. They said goodbye and thanked each other for their help. They wondered if they'd ever meet again. After a long night, they were both finally off the moon. The boy went one way and the Martian went another, both on their way back home. The End of The Way Back Home by Oliver Jeffers Here 
on the Lights Out podcast. Bedtime stories for boys and girls and Martians with broken engines around the world. Good night.